This video is going to explain how to apply headings to a Microsoft Word document. Now I have a preferred uh, method for applying headings and the first thing I like to do is press Control F on my keyboard to bring up the navigation menu. From here, I'm going to select headings on the left hand side. Now as I begin to add headings, we will see them appear in this navigation menu. The goal here is to build an outline of the heading structure to make sure that all of our headings are in the correct order. The very first set of words on the page are called Volcano Practice. This is going to be our heading level one. Now there's a couple different ways I can apply this. I can select heading one from the quick styles menu or I can press Control alt and the corresponding number on the keyboard. So for formation, I'm going to select Control alt 2 to apply a heading level 2. And then on the left hand side, we can see our outline begin to take shape. I'm going to scroll through this document and look for some additional headings here. I have properties, I'm going to make that a heading level 2. And then I have chemical, I'm going to make this a heading level 3. We have physical, this will also be a heading level 3. And then I have components. This will be a heading level four, and I can select that from the styles menu. And we can just keep going through this document and apply our headings. The goal here is to make sure we get them all in the correct order and that our outline makes sense. There are a couple of important notes about headings and styles within Microsoft Word. H1, or a heading 1, is the most important idea on the page. Any subsections should begin with an H2. We want to ensure that our document has at least one heading 1, and it's very important that we do not skip heading levels. Additionally, do not select heading levels based on their appearance. We can change those at any time. Do not use bolding or larger font to make it appear as a heading we need to set the structure of that content as a heading. And then finally, you want to only use a heading one through a heading level six, as that is what most assistive technologies will recognize. And that concludes how to apply headings to a Microsoft Word document. Thank you for watching.